Scientific classification, also known as biological classification or taxonomy, is a hierarchical system used by scientists to organize and categorize living organisms based on their evolutionary relationships. It helps to group similar organisms together and provides a standardized way to name and classify them. Let's use Ankylosaurus, a well-known dinosaur, as an example to understand how scientific classification works. First up, we have the kingdom. This is the broadest level of classification and groups organisms into five major categories. Animalia, Plantae, Fungi, Protista, and Monera. The Ankylosaurus belongs to the Animalia kingdom. Moving on to the phylum level. Phylum further divides the animal kingdom into distinct groups based on anatomical characteristics. For example, chordata includes animals with a backbone, such as mammals, birds, amphibians, fish, and reptiles, like the ankylosaurus. Other major groups are arthropoda, which includes insects, and crustacea. And mollusca, which includes animals like snails, slugs, clams, mussels, and oysters. Next, we have the class level. Classes are smaller groups within a phylum that share more specific characteristics. In the case of the Ankylosaurus, it belongs to the class Reptilia, which includes animals like lizards, turtles, and all dinosaurs. Now, the order level. Orders are subdivisions within a class that group together closely related families. Dinosaurs can be divided into two main orders, depending on their hip structure. Saurischia and Ornithischia. Our Ankylosaurus falls into the order Ornithischia, which includes all four-legged dinosaurs, except for sauropods. Sauropods and theropods like T. rex and raptors belong to the order Saurischia. Moving down the hierarchy, we arrive at the family level. Families are divisions within an order that share even more specific characteristics. The Ankylosaurus belongs to the Ankylosauridae family, along with its close relatives. Then, we reach the genus level. Ankylosaurus is the genus name. The genus represents a more specific group within a family and comprises closely related species. Finally, we arrive at the species level, where we gain the most specific information about an animal. Ankylosaurus magnaventris is the specific species name. The species represents a particular type of organism within a genus. Ankylosaurus magnaventris is known for its massive size and well-developed tail club. Scientific classification is, put simply, a systematic way of organizing and categorizing living organisms based on the shared characteristics. This helps scientists study and communicate about different species in a clear and structured manner. Thanks for joining us, and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell.